Hey everyone, how it's going? Akshay here and welcome back to TechBinder. So today in this video, we're going to install this Whitestone tempered glass on our new Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So we're going to install this and let's figure it out how well it works on the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So without any further ado, let's get started in this video. So here comes our Whitestone Dome Galaxy Note 10 Plus and you can even use this for Note 10 Plus 5G because the dimensions are the same. Only the difference is that this is having a 5G chip, this one is not having. So this Whitestone Dome glass covers the full 4 protection that is full ultrasonic recognition, full clarity, full coverage and full filling. So they ask you to re-register your fingerprint once you attach the dome glass so that the accuracy level increases multifold. So they are having a liquid optical clear adhesive which is known as LOCA technology so that you can use it on the ultrasonic fingerprint. So they are very less tempered glass which works on ultrasonic fingerprint and I am really happy that this is one of them. So let's unbox it and let's find the content of this tempered glass. Okay. So here are the content, so this is the installation guide and here we are having one more installation guide which is like a revision guide because they have done some changes and also they say that if you want to have better touch sensitivity you need to go to setting then display and turn on touch sensitivity to get better sensitivity using this tempered glass okay. So here we are having this installation tab. So this is an, a suction cup. This is something new which was not involved in the S10 plus installation guide. And I will tell you how to do this. Keeping the aside, here we are having a couple of things. Cotton swab to clean your phone. And dust remover sticker. Some microfiber cloth. And these two tabs should be installed on the side. Uh, so if there is loca gel spill, it get absorbed by these two pads. And also our earphone protector, our top tray and finally the Note 10 Plus tempered glass. So this one is having a teardrop notch type style. So they have given two Luka gel tubes. So if by mistake if you do not install with one, you can always try with the second one. Okay. And the bridge. So here it is. So step number one, you should remove the back cover if it is installed. Also the Samsung are giving a pre-applied screen protector which is good at the initial usage but it's not the best so you need to remove that screen protector so that you can install this tempered glass and you will find that this this is not a great piece of protector because see it get a lot of scratches and dents which will affect your phone also so i would recommend you to install a better screen protector than the pre-applied one so before installing this i would recommend to shut down your phone to shut down your phone press and hold the big speed button and the volume down button because there is no dedicated power button and click on power off here you will find that they have written speaker on the bottom tray which means this side up and install the phone and grab an alcohol cotton pad clean your phone thoroughly by using this alcohol pad don't forget to clean at the edges also grab a microfiber cloth and clean the extra alcohol from your phone grab a dust remover sticker and look for any fine particles onto your phone and use this dust remover sticker to clean it thoroughly. Once you're satisfied, let's move to the step number two. Install the top plate and align it properly so that the speaker one get aligned with the speaker one. Install this bridge on the top of your phone. Grab a loca tube. There will be two caps on this loca tube. One is colored one, one will be black. So first open the colored tube and place it firmly and attach it onto your bridge once you are satisfied just remove the top cap and let the liquid spill onto your phone leave it for 30 seconds so that the all liquid gets spilled onto your phone so moving to the next step remove the upper bridge and install this tab onto your phone before doing anything now we need to put our tempered glass remove this back portion and place it firmly onto your phone just look that it is aligned perfectly onto your phone and here we are having this installation guide and there will be a protruding part and there will be a plain part to install the suction cup on the top part and align it like this bring it down so that our loca is at the, this center and once you find that it is in center remove this 
and let the local gel spread onto your phone. Do not do anything in this process. Just let it be there for 2 minutes so that it get evenly spread onto your phone. Now let's move to the next step. So here you will find that we are having this ultraviolet light. Just install it. Okay. So there is a dedicated button to turn it on and off. So now we need to remove the installation tab. Just press and hold your top plate and take it firmly out of your phone. Now moving to the next step. We need to cure our phone. So there is short curing and long curing. In short curing, we will cure our phone 15 seconds in the bottom and 15 seconds to the top. Now remove the top plate and remove this sticker which we have installed onto our earpiece. Now grab an alcohol and remove the extra loca gel from the phone. So now we need to cure the bottom and top part each for at least one minute. So the screen looks pretty much mesmerizing and it's really great to have this tempered glass and it doesn't feel like there's tempered glass installed on it. Now let's test our fingerprint. Wow. It works flawlessly. Now if you find that the touch sensitivity is not pretty great, just go to the settings and the display and turn on touch sensitivity so that it increases the touch sensitivity of the screen for while you are using the screen protector. If it is turned off, turn it on. So this is the best screen protector available in the market for Note 10 Plus in which ultrasonic fingerprint works perfectly. So I hope you like this video and if you are not subscribed to my channel until yet, click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get latest video notification. Thank you for watching, have a nice day and catch you in the next video.